Hey guys, welcome back. <laughs> I'm out here in St. Vincent and the Grenadines, the Caribbean still, and I am starting a new day, a new vlog. Uh, we are going into town. We need to get, we're gonna get some fish. I'm gonna do a come cook with me later on, some of our island's fish and stuff like this. It's, what is it today? I think it's 31 degrees. Uh, it's about 8 a.m. in the morning. So we are heading down there because it gets very busy. It's our only sort of main town. We do have another one in the countryside, but this is the nearest one to us. Kingston um, is the capital for us. Anyway, so yeah, let's start this day. I've noticed every time I'm, I'm showing you my mirror, my um, bed is a mess. I tell you what, you get so flustered in the morning that you just can't be asked. Uh, today I'm wearing a pre-mark dress, a navy blue dress. Just a plain simple dress. I paid six pounds for it in the sale. I think last year sometime I would have hauled it. Um, just something a bit free, but trust me, as the night falls, you gotta get your long pants on and your long sleeves on because the mosquitoes come out to bite. <laughs> Today, my shoes, um, I had these made here. There's a guy that does uh, make leather shoes, well, leather sandals. And I had this made um, last year, uh, sort of Caribbean Island sandals. And uh, I paid about uh, $25, which is about, I don't know, 12 pounds or something. Not even that, I don't think. Uh, yeah, so that's my shoes for today. It is so busy, hustling. I've had to change again because it wasn't appropriate what I had on. My arms were out too much and my legs were, so I've put some trousers on. But yeah, we're in town. Let me turn the camera around. Over there, you can get some really lovely uh, roti right there, uh, rich at the Richies. And they've got some more food stuff here. And then, I mean, I don't know, I can't really see in my camera because the sun is glaring in my face. So I hope I'm recording okay. So I'm at the bank, come to get some money. This is uh, one of our biggest banks, uh, First National Bank. Yes, this is sort of the center of Kingston. So we've come to a bar in town, rooftop um, bar, and look, there's P&O out in the uh, in the distance. You can see the ship. You can see Government House. This is like Parliament for us, if you like. This is their building here. So their car park. Um, I don't want to drop my phone, but if I look down into the city, it's buzzing, going all the way up.
So guys, we are on our way home and I thought I'd come out the car to show you the piano and the seas and this here, all of this here is the capital of St. Vincent, Kingston, all of that down here. It's a lovely view, lovely day. Hey, beautiful people, I'm back home. It's about three o'clock and we're deciding whether or not do we want to go to the beach or do we just have a little bit of a rest. Today, Friday night, maybe we'll go to a bar and have a drink. Well, you know me, I can't drink. Um, so we're deciding what we're gonna do later on. We're gonna just have a shower, change, and go back out again and find something to do. So that's me pit stop. Guys, if you like what you're seeing so far, please don't forget to subscribe. Just hit the subscribe button for me. That'd be absolutely wonderful. And I'll see you at the next stop. Right, um, yeah, so you know what? We've got some of the most beautiful homes in the Caribbean here. Um, apparently we were on some sort of list saying that we have the most beautiful homes in the Caribbean. Oh, don't come for me if you are from somewhere somewhere else in the islands. Um, that's what I read. <laughs> that we have the most beautiful homes in St. St. Vincent and, the, you know, the Caribbean. We have the most lovely homes. I've just shown you a few. Coconut Grove is an absolutely beautiful site. It's a new um, place to come. It's only been developing the last two, three years, I, I believe. Um, they put white sands down and they've, it, this was just all forest at some point. Um, and someone's overseas has come and seen that there's potential this part of the island and they've turned it into a little of mini resort. They have everything for the kids, they have everything for adults, they have a nightlife, they've got beautiful suites you can stay here. It definitely is one of my favourite places to come when I come home. It's absolutely gorgeous. The love from St. Vincent and the Grenadines. Okay. <laughs> oh, I'm coming down. Come get me. Coconut Grove, we're gonna have a bit of dinner and a bit of lunch. A little, a bit of a, they have a, a little bit of a park for the little ones while you're eating here, which I haven't seen before. This is cute, very nice. Climbing frames, very lovely, great. They've got good selection on their uh, menu. Uh, everything for everyone, to be honest with you. Great menu. Mm -hmm.
Hey guys, I'm back home and I'm knackered. It's about nine o'clock. We do have a um, nightclub. You probably could hear it in the background. We have a nightclub at the end of the uh, road here. Um, it's for sort of older people, but um, they pe do karaoke, um, have drinks. Quite a friendly bar, actually. My other half is walked down there, but I'm just not in the mood. I am knackered. So guys, look, I really appreciate you spending the whole day with me in the Caribbean. Um, I, I really do. I don't know if I'm gonna do another vlog. Um, I do have another, I think about five days here and um, I think I'm just gonna chill out. Um, if I do, if there is anything interesting, I, I'll bring it to you. But if not, I will see you back in England. All right, so guys, please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, um, and I will see you in my next video. Mwah.